Our motoring tip of the week comes to you from the Toronto Boat Show. We're at the Mastercraft wakeboarding booth and right beside me is the Ilmore 6.2 liter engine that's used in some of these Mastercraft wakeboarding boats. Now, if you recognize that Ilmore name, and I did right away when I saw this engine, Ilmore Engineering for decades has built the race engines for Penske Racing and Roger Penske owns Ilmore Engineering. So they built those uh, IndyCar race engines for many, many years. And this engine right here, the 6.2 Pushrod V8, uh, is starts out life as a General Motors uh, V8 engine that would be in a GMC or Chev pickup, similar to the V8 engine in Corvettes and many rear wheel drive Cadillac SUVs. Now this 6.2 engine is direct injected and it, the, the crate engine goes to Elmore Engineering in Mooresville, North Carolina, and then they marinize it. And the term marinizing it means that they marine configure that engine. So they add all the peripheral parts that make that engine specific for a marine application. So they've got a, a, sh a show engine here on the stand that we can get a real good look at. And we see the heat exchanger at the front. Now, this heat exchanger does the same function as the radiator in your car or truck. And it takes uh, lake water and it, it's got a, this particular engine has a closed cooling system. So there's antifreeze circulating in part of the cooling system and it takes lake water in and the heat exchanger here, uh, as the name implies, exchanges the heat. On the marine engine, we've got liquid cooled manifolds right here. Uh, in order to keep the manifolds uh, cool enough for marine operation, that's a must. Up here, we've got a catalytic converter in the exhaust manifold. And this is one of the first applications of a catalytic converter for marine use. And this allows this engine to achieve California Air Resources Board five-star rating. This is the first engine to achieve it. And this allows this engine to be very fuel efficient and very clean burning. So the exhaust emissions are tremendously reduced with this type of a system. So this is where automotive technology has migrated its way over to the marine industry. But this engine starts out life as the same pushrod engine. In fact, it's delivered to Ilmore Engineering, assembled from GM. So the block, the crank, the rods, pistons, all the internals of the engine are shared with GM road going vehicles. It's all the peripheral equipment on this engine that's specific to marine. Bottom line is changing the oil, changing the filter, just as important in this engine as, as it is in your pickup truck or car. That's your motoring tip of the week.